guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing my first ever unboxing because I love watching these videos. So I just got a package from Box Lunch of some stuff that I ordered from them using some coupons and various gift cards from Christmas. I am also going to be showing you a few little things that I picked up from various stores using the Christmas gift cards and yeah, just some things that I haven't opened yet. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. So let's get into this box because I am excited. <laughs> Alright, so we've got a ton of dunnage on top here. So we've got the packing list, a how to return, and then I have this box lunch Sailor Moon brochure and it's for $25 off your next purchase of $75 or more. Yeah, it already started, so that's kind of cool. It's good until next month to keep you on the loop of buying stuff. I see what they're doing. Let's get this out of the way. Ooh, it's so pretty. I thought this had everything in it and now that I'm looking at it, it doesn't. <laughs> So I think I have one more in the mail, so this video might be a little bit patchy. So this is the first thing that I got, and it is a Loungefly Pooh Bear purse. Ooh, it's super pretty. I love how they packaged it. It's super secure, and it's not going to get dense in it. So yeah, this is super cute. They even have a little straps padded. But yeah, this is just a really nice bag that I picked up from Loungefly because for Christmas, my boyfriend got me a bag and they gave him lunch lunchbox money. So with the lunchbox money, if you spend if you spend thirty dollars, you get fifteen dollars off. So he had a couple of those. So this ended up being basically free when I purchased everything that I got from box lunch because of the coupons. So it just has Pooh Bear and all his friends, the whole gang, and then it has leaves on the side. Oh my gosh, the inside is like poo honey pot print, I guess. <laughs> it's striped with um, yellow and red. My only downfall to these bags, they make these pockets on the side so small, there's no way you could fit any type of beverage in here. But I guess you could fit like your keys or your phone, so I don't know. The other thing that I got from Loungefly, from, from Loungefly, from Box Lunch, is this adorable Pooh Bear beanie because it was just too cute to pass up and very one of a kind and it's super bright. All my other beanies are basically black or gray, so I was like, oh, this will fit nicely in my collection. So it just says poo on it and it has poo bear embroidered on it. So it's just adorable. I love that they included all of him. I thought it was just going to be like the top of him, but you could actually pull it down and then it would just be a super long beanie with poo embroidered on it. Hey guys, it's a whole different day, but I'm just adding this insert in because I had a little bit of trouble with the Meredith shirt. As you guys saw, I ended up talking to the shipping company they had no idea where the shirt was. It wasn't that they had no record of shipping anything else to my residence. So then I called the store, which the shipping company told me to do. I did that, called them, and Lunchbox is part of Hot Topic, if you don't know that already. So I called Hot Topic, told them about my situation, and they said, oh yeah, that shirt's actually on its way today, and it'll be there by the end of the day. So I was waiting for a while. I had plans later in that day. So I got back home around like 11 o'clock, 11.30. Still no shirt at the front door. So then I was like, okay, maybe it's in the mailbox. Check the mailbox and it was there. The struggle is real for me today because the camera battery died as soon as I started to film this. Of course. This is how the shirt looks. It says curly hair, don't care on it. And it's got Merida and Vanellope on it. And it's just a muscle tee tank top. One warning about this shirt, it is not sold in stores. It's an online exclusive, but it says to wash first because it smells a little bit weird. I put it on. It smells like vinegar. I still haven't washed it yet. It says to wash it before you use it because it smells weird, and it says that it's because of the printing process that they use, 
but that it goes away within the first wash. So let's get on with the rest of the video. They are the heartthrob with the dinosaur on it. My sister picked these up for me. Another dinosaur thing I got is this little guy. Wait for it. Isn't that awesome? It's a sanitizer keychain. It's from Bath and Body Works and he is just a cute little green dinosaur and I thought it would go perfect with my other lounge fly which is Rex themed from Toy Story. So this is going on there. Another thing I picked up from REI, I think that's how you say it, is this tank top, well crop tank top slash bra, bralette type thing. I think it's called a bralette. It's super comfortable and it's got the two layers so it's got this tank top and then like a mesh breathable sports bra with removable cups on the sides so this is just a cute really basic crop these were free when i got my macbook and i've had my macbook for about two years or a year i've had my macbook and these came with it and i was like i'm gonna sell them or whatever because it was a promotion like selling them online just seems like such a chore and I really want some new headphones, so I was like, oh, I have those beats in my closet. I can just open them. Change the way you hear sound. I have very high expectations now, Beats. Just letting you know. And then it has this cute little packaging. Has anyone else ever thrown away their phone box when they buy a new phone and never lifted up the thing to see the stuff underneath? I told a friend about that and they were like, what, there's stuff on the other side of the box? And I was like, you've been throwing away headphones for a very long time now. Like, so it's not wireless. The instructions, your girl loves instructions. I never read them until I can't figure it out and then I get frustrated, but I have instructions. A beat sticker. And then we've got some important safety information in multiple languages. Then we have the charger and a carabiner. I think I've only used Beats one time and they were my boyfriend's because I needed a pair of headphones and he only had Beats. Okay, so you charge it on one side and then the other side you can use as on-ear controls for wireless mode, but then it has like the phone jack and stuff on this side. These are nice. The struggle is real to get these back in the bag. Ten minutes later, she's figuring out how to close the freaking Beats case. Yeah. I don't know who would stick these on their backpack. Can you talk about, like, someone would definitely steal these if these were just dangling from my backpack. Alright guys, that's all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed this quirky weird video full of mixed emotions and that you enjoyed my quirky weirdness unboxing these packages. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more weird videos from me and go check out my blog maddieautumnfaith.com if you want to see more content from me. I really appreciate it. Thanks guys. I will see you in the next one. Bye!